And welcome back to Final Fantasy XIV, The Maiden's Rhapsody, Episode 3. Now this one, yes, it comes to me now, Mortal Struggle, Forbidden Magics, that are in a final bid for salvation. Wolf. Is he gonna walk over there? No. It all makes sense now. Pitch battles, arduous journeys, the fellowship adventures. And it's not my life that I recall, but rather the tales of a great hero I must took as myself. I suspect that such feats were truly strong to be my own, and the memories held within the stone have removed all doubt. Every journey in the past, one that revealed a horrible truth I dare not repeat aloud. Our own found a deal, and not some terrible continent, but an entirely different world. You're going to turn me now, and it's all thanks to you. More importantly, I believe now in the center of the wheel of Matsukiori. Should not be long before my path almost clear to me as well, but first I must see my training to its completion. While waiting here, I heard on suddenly stories of foul beasts terrorizing Bronze Lake. I need to put into practice everything I've learned. Today is the day I wield the power of a Matsukiori. After this last endeavor, let us meet the limbs of the Minza. What I don't get about Bronze Lake and all that stuff is, shouldn't like almost entirely know she like flooded briefly. Oh, then. Uh huh. Can I? Nope. Oh. Because, yeah, I would not have been able to do this. Oh, that might help. Oh, so much for that.
Oh, is she gonna do like a big bang attack? I see the dread dragon to just like sit there. That's the Sweeney now. It's looking summer to walk up. Again, I don't know why I'm not doing that. It's all thanks to you. You always uh, keep me on the path. That's because we want to but not here. Let's make for Limsa Lominza. Yeah, I'll listen to some Eleven songs during my uh, run today. I guess it's more of a walk because I'm still getting used to, like, you know, <laughs> I guess standing up in a way.
Let me see, nine inches to... So 19 inches times 2.54. That can't be right. Yeah, thirty nine inches. Well, that's about Matsu Kiori's mind to command in my memories. <coughs> Slowly but surely returning. An impossible not for your unwavering guidance. You can find on a mission so vital. My resolve was unyielding. My mind focused on the task before me. If you may have jeopardized all I hold dear. Either my home is, or rather was, a world known as Vanadil. I was rushing to know me for so long, but fate saw fit to give me one last chance. I tried back in time to escape to the past before the darkness had consumed all. The past I knew that treasure could be diverted, just as it had been so many times before. I guess I'm all a hero without equal, whose grand ventures I mistook as my own memories. I can help but feel I'm suffering in something that's important, something that happened to Master. Hmm. Time will come to me. Really, might we go speak with the remove, not for insistence. Or after your assistance, it'd be rude not to accept my thanks for as well. So it, so it is, um... Coastal Soul? No. Good. What the hell? What? Wait. I think it's 14 is more aptly a prequel. <coughs> now, the good news. The memory is for the most part restored. Perhaps more importantly, your training is complete. You can come with me to the coastal little soy just so she'd still be swinging at crabs along the beach. Uh, have you ever much like talked to you about my store? <clears throat> you doing before we arrived? How exactly did you come here to be in New Orleans? Yeah. And you say you went back in time trying to save your world? Yes, you have the right of it. No life is spared by the darkness, and unsafe for mine, that is. Fate intervened and I was sent back to the past, to a time where I could find 
Heroes capable of saving Vanadil. Hello, I reunite with Master, although at much earlier time than I anticipated. Last thing I remember is a fierce battle in a strange light. So I woke up here to be torn away from Master when I was needed most. Feels like it may burst. So I'm guessing my character is Master. How awful you were close, then. Master was like family to me, an exception on all besides. Uh, my entire life trying to lie, starting to be so much a hero and live up to legends I so fondly remember. Yeah, and you'll notice that Master is, uh, nondescript. I'll begin with a stone, or so the story says. Ah, yes, it's the intro. I like how the cutscenes are like in the same resolution. These past the sending jewel, and over some beautiful banished darkness. So I filled the world with life and brought forth mighty gods. World entered an age of bliss that is until the gods fell in a slumber. World is my home, Vanadil. <laughs> As home to the three great nations, the kingdom of Sundiora, probably like a bus stock in the Federation of Windurst. As they were, though, in time of strife, they returned to a single hero, my master. Oh, it's that fucker. Uh, be it as a demon of rage seeking vengeance, or a spiteful god or destruction, or is it pulls back from the brink of oblivion? They're 19 hours. I think it was something like 29 or something stupid like that. He turned into wolf. In the light in life in the world, the legend of Vanadil's greatest hero will live on. That's for Alvarga? It's Alexander? Wait a second. The weird looking cat. I'm the wonder in these stories were the first to spring back to my mind. I probably memorize them, but no matter how many times I asked you, you would always. Oh. But please, I looked at you and something in your eyes remind me, Master and I. Oh, that's really fucking sweet. I mean, it's over imagine a friend as often as it affects on people. Uh, because it seems anyone in the right mind would think it's some festival dream. For me, this world is a dream. Now it's time to awaken. The next time I eyes, I'll be home in Vanadil once more on Master's side. Maybe just a dream, but it's one I shall never forget. Thank you for everything. Shouldn't I, like, ca Oh. Never mind. It's because there is no Vanadil anymore. That seemed like you yeah, to return. Is this perhaps the will of the goddess? What, why, why are you laughing? How's that funny? It is by her will, then so it shall be. I've had to work hard every day to become a warrior worthy of your teachings. When the time comes, we shall meet again. Here in your rosier, perhaps in the waking world. What the? Is this Bloodborne? I guess the greatest story I'll never get a right. An adventure from another world, traveling back in time to save her people? At least such a silly tale. He'll fight to find him, Peter. For her sake, I hope she finds a way home, wherever that may be. Hooray! Have an eleven. So wait a second, um, isn't there supposed to be, like, another quest or something?
<sighs> Characters from... Shantato, I think? Yes. Well, I'm guessing, yeah. Even though it's like six years older than Frontier. This image. Hm. 
Alright, so...